One of the best new features in macOS is the Erase All Content and Settings. It's available on macOS Monterey and later, and it is different in macOS Ventura, so I'm going to show you both ways. It's available on Apple T2 security chip Intel Macs, as well as Apple Silicon Macs. To check your Mac, go up to the Apple menu in About This Mac and look at your specs right there to see if it'll work. In macOS Monterey, we're going to open up System Preferences and go up to the System Preferences menu down to Erase All Content and Settings. In Ventura, we're going to go through the whole process. So open up System Settings, click on General, and then you're going to click on Transfer or Reset. Select the Erase All Content and Settings button. Enter in an admin password to unlock. This will sign you out of your Apple ID. Remove any Touch ID, unpair Bluetooth devices, remove Apple Wallet, and disable Find My and Activation Lock. Click Continue and sign out of your Apple ID. You might get an error message stating that you can't reach iCloud. Just click Later on that message and click the Erase All Content and Settings button. It will take a couple seconds and then it will reboot your Mac and load the Activate Mac screen. At this point, you're going to want to connect to either Ethernet or set up your Wi-Fi like I'm going to do here. I'm going to enter in my password and connect it to my Wi-Fi so it can actually activate the Mac. At this point, it's going to take a couple seconds and you're going to get a restart in one minute. I'm just going to go down to click restart. Once the Mac restarts, it's going to come up to the hello screen. And at this point, if you're going to sell the Mac, you can just power it down at this point or log in and create a new account. A cool new feature in macOS Ventura is Stage Manager, so go check out this video here. Let me know in the comments what your favorite feature is in macOS.